Hello again and welcome to the studio. I'm Scooter. If you are looking for some basic tips on audio production and editing in Adobe Audition, I'm here to help. This time dealing with splitting audio in the multi-track view. You need to do that sometimes if you are going to add some music, sound effects, or other production pieces to your audio. So let's get started. Here I have a voice track that I need to cut up into pieces because I need to use different parts of it at different places in my project. For instance, I'll need to put music under one part of it, sound effects under another part of it, and separate some of it with sound bites in between. So what I'm going to do is show you one way to do it, but not my preferred way. My preferred way will be in the next video. However, this tip might help you in other audio projects. So let's get started here. I'm going to go into multi-track to do this because I want to lay it down first. And I do that by hitting F12, or you can also go to View and go Multi-Track. You can also click Multi-Track right here. All right, now, I'm going to drag my voice track right here to track one. And I'm going to start splitting up my voice track. What I do is I place my cursor where I want that first split to be. And when I hit Control plus K, I have split it right where the cursor was. See? You've got two different blocks now. Pull that away, and I know that I want my next split to be there. Control K. Pull it away. Let me zoom in on this one. I know that I want it right there. By the way, Control K is the keyboard shortcut, but you can also come up here. And first of all, we need to highlight where we want it to be. Come up to Clip, and then to Split. And you've done it that way. Now, I'm not going to continue on because I think you get the point by now. But once you've got them all cut up, you can place them anywhere you want. I'm holding down the right button on my mouse and dragging it anywhere I like. This is the intro to the piece of audio that I'm doing here and there will be a little bit of noise here and I'll place a music bed here and then this will come right after that with a new music bed starting right in here right there and then there will be a sound bite here and I'll put that there and the sound bite will be right up in here and so on that is not my preferred method of cutting up audio and using it in a multi-track session Next video, I'll show you my preferred method. Now, again, that splitting audio tip can come in handy in more ways than one, as you will find out as you become more comfortable with editing. By the way, thank you for all the new YouTube subscriptions. I do appreciate it. Uh, I am flattered by that. I kid you not. Also, please keep the questions coming. I'll see you next time.